Hello, welcome. In this video, we will look at an example illustrating how to do an 8 point DFT sequence. Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at an example illustrating how to apply the decimation in time, that is DIT FFT algorithm to find the 8 point DFT sequence of a given 8 point X signal, given 8 point signal, that is given the signal X of N given the signal x of n which has the values 1 comma 1 comma 1 and zeros that is the rest of the values are zeros that is given this 8 point sequence we want to find the x of k that is the dft of this signal x of n using dit that is decimation in time radix to fft algorithm fft algorithm so in order to de determine the dft sequence using this DIT FFT algorithm, we need the butterfly diagram. That is, we have to draw the butterfly diagram for the DIT FFT algorithm. So we have the input x of n which is given by 1 1 1 first for the first 3 values and zeros for the next 5 values. So given this signal we have to apply this DIT FFT algorithm. So let us evaluate the result uh, stage by stage. So the first stage that is in the first stage the inputs have to be reorganized in the following order that is we have x of 0 x of 4 and then x of 2, x of 6, this is because of the decimation in time. We have x of 0, x of 4, x of 2, x of 6 and then followed by x of 1, x of 5 and x of 3 and x of 7. So from the given input sequence, the corresponding values are 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0. So that is the input sequence after decimation in time. That is, now the shuffled inputs are basically written as follows. That is, we have x of 0 here, x of 4 here, x of 2 here, x of 6 here, and x of 1 here, x of 5 here, and then x of 3 and x of 6. Note that these values are equal to 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, and 0, 0, 0. So, upon uh, operations of at stage 1 that is uh, stage 1 so the outputs of the stage 1 will be uh, can be easily computed as follows so for the first one the output will be 1 plus 0 so it should be 1 so the output is 1 and second one the output is again 1 minus 0 so it is again 1 and then the x of 2 that is on the line corresponding to x of 2 the output will be 1 plus 0 1 and then multiplied by w8 power 0 which is also 1 so the output will be 1 and in the fourth line that is from 1 and mi minus 0 so 1 and then multiplied with w8 power 2 which is basically uh, uh, e power minus j 2 pi by 8 whole power 2 that means it will be equal to w8 power 2 will be equal to e power minus j 2 pi divided by 8 whole square which is basically e power minus j 4 pi by 8 which is e power minus j pi by 2 which is equal to minus j or minus 1 j therefore this value is minus 1 j and in the second section that is x of n it will be 1 minus 0 or 1 plus 0 it is 1 and then 1 minus 0 again 1 and then 0 uh, plus 0 and doesn't really matter when you multiply when you multiply with w8 power 0 so the output is still 0 and then this also is 0 so the output of stage 1 is the, out the output of stage 1 the output of stage 1 is given here 1 1 1 
माइनस वन जे वन वन जीरो एंड जीरो वन 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 द आउटपुट ऑफ स्टेज वन इज वन 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 माइनस जे वन वन एंड टू जीरोस नाउ विल गो टू सेकंड स्टेज सो हैव वन 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 माइनस वन जे वन वन एंड जीरो जीरो नाउ वी गो टू द आउटपुट्स ऑफ सेकंड स्टेज स्टेज टू सो द आउटपुट्स विल बी सो द आउटपुट्स हियर बिकम इनपुट्स हियर सो दे आर ऑल बोथ दे आर बोथ वन सो वी हैव वन एंड द इनपुट हियर आर ऑल्सो वन एंड माइनस वन जे सो द आउटपुट एट दिस पॉइंट इज वन प्लस वन सो इट शुड बी टू सो नेक्स्ट वी हैव द आउटपुट हियर इज वन एंड माइनस वन जे सो इट शुड बी वन माइनस जे एंड हियर द आउटपुट इज द आउटपुट इज वन माइनस वन सो जीरो एंड हियर इट इज वन माइनस ऑफ माइनस वन जे सो इट इज वन प्लस एंड इन द सेकेंड सेक्शन वी हैव वन प्लस जीरो सो इट्स इक्वल टू वन एंड हियर इट विल बी वन अगेन सेकेंड पार्ट इज जीरो सेकेंड इनपुट इज जीरो सो अगेन द आउटपुट विल बी वन इन वन मल्टीप्लाइड बाई डबल यू एट पावर वन सो सो डबल यू एट पावर वन इज ई पावर माइनस जे टू पाई बाई एट दैट मीन्स ई पावर माइनस जे पाई बाई फोर सो दैट मीन्स कॉस पाई बाई फोर दैट इज वन बाई रूट टू एंड माइनस वन बाई रूट टू जे सो दैट इज डबल यू एट पावर वन सो बाई यूजिंग दैट वैल्यू वी हैव सो इट कैन बी रिप्रेजेंटेड इन शॉर्ट एज ई पावर माइनस e power minus j pi by 4 so it is e power minus j pi by 4 and in the uh, seventh line that is we have a 1 and a 0 so the difference is again 1 and then that is 1 minus 0 is 1 and then we have w8 power 2 which is basically minus 1j so 1 into minus 1j is again minus 1j and then the last one that is uh, 1 minus 0 so again 1 and then we have w8 power 3 Which is basically e power minus j three pi by four. So one into e power minus j three pi by four. So these are the in outputs of the second stage. So the outputs of the second stage can be written as output of stage two consists of two one minus j zero one plus j one e power minus j pi by four that is one by root two. Minus one by root two j, and then minus j, and then we also have e power minus j three pi by four. So these are the outputs in the second stage. Now output of the final stage, that is the stage three. The output in the stage three can be written as follows. That is, we have the inputs two minus j zero one plus j minus uh, plus one e power minus j pi by four minus one j and e power minus j three pi by four. So using these inputs. Now let us look at the outputs at the stage three. That is, the outputs at stage three can be computed as follows. So for this first one, x of zero will be equal to two uh, plus one. So it should be equal to three. And then second one, x of one will be equal to we have one minus j plus e power minus j pi by four. So it should be one plus one by root two plus that is cos pi by four is one by root two, and then we have Minus j and minus sine pi by four. That is sine forty five. So it should be minus of one plus one by root two j. So that is x of one. And then x of two will be simply zero and minus one j. So it is equal to minus one. And x of three again is going to be equal to one plus j and then e power minus j three pi by four. So it is equal to one minus one by root two. That is cos three pi by four is minus one by root two, and then we have plus j, and then minus j sine three pi by four. So it should be equal to one minus one by root two j, and then we have x of four, which is going to be two minus one. So it is one, and then x of five will be equal to one minus j minus of this term. That is e power minus j pi by four. So it is one minus one by root two, minus of one minus one by root. That is we have minus j, and also minus of minus sine pi by four. So it is plus one by root two j. So we have minus of one minus one by root two j. And similarly, x of six, x of six will be zero minus of minus one j. So it is one j. And finally, x of seven should be conjugate of x of 
So x of 7 is a conjugate of x of 1 since we are talking about only real signals. So it is 1 plus 1 by root 2 and plus 1 plus 1 by root 2 j. So finally, the output at stage 3 that is the output of stage 3 that is we have the values x of 0 which is equal to 3 and then x of 1 which is equal to 1 plus 1 by root 2 minus of 1 plus 1 by root 2 j and then we have x of 2 which is minus 1 j and then we have x of 3 which is 1 minus 1 by root 2 and then plus 1 minus 1 by root 2 j and we also have x of 4 x of 4 is 1 x of 5 should be conjugate of x of 3 so it is 1 minus 1 by root 2 and then minus of 1 minus 1 by root 2 j and then x of 6 which is conjugate of x of 2 so it is 1 j and finally x of 7 which is conjugate of x of 1 so it is 1 plus 1 by root 2 plus 1 plus 1 by root 2 j. So to summarize we have looked at the DIT FFT algorithm that is application of the DIT FFT algorithm to a 8 point sequence to find the 8 point DFT sequence. So the first stage uh, we have the inputs uh, ordered as x of 0, x of 4, x of 2, x of 6, x of 1, x of 5, x of 3 and x of 7 and then uh, using the butterfly diagram the outputs of the stage 1 are 1 1 1 minus 1 j 1 1 0 0 and again uh, the outputs of the stage 2 are 2 1 minus j 0 1 plus j 1 e power minus j pi by 4 minus 1 j e power minus j 3 pi by 4 and the outputs of stage 3 that is the final outputs are which are basically the uh, DFT sequence values uh, the, these are 3 and then 1 plus 1 by root 2 minus 1 plus 1 by root 2 j and then minus 1 j for x of 2 x of 3 is 1 minus 1 by root 2 plus 1 minus 1 by root 2 j x of 4 is 1 x of 5 is conjugate of x of 3 x of 6 is conjugate of x of 2 and x of 7 is conjugate of x of 1. So basically we have uh, exploited the uh, butterfly diagram to, uh, to determine the values of the 8 point DFT sequence using decimation in time algorithm that is decimation in time fast Fourier transform algorithm. Thanks for watching.